Welcome everybody. We're gonna cover one of the gaming assets in crypto world. Gods Unchained, ticker GODS. Is the gaming narrative back? Well, for Gods Unchained, yes. This coin is up over 100% in the last week. You see this huge candle, God candle-like in the four hour chart. We went from 18 cents to 34 cents in one soup. Huge volumes are present for the asset. So we'll cover today the four hour and the daily to give you an idea of what to look forward for Gods Unchained. So on the four hour, we got a golden cross. You see it here, the MA50 cross the MA200 for this gaming token. We have huge volumes associated with this move. We went from a base of 18, like I said, to a top of 34. We corrected back to 26, and now we're trading around 30 cents, which is an even number. It's quite normal. You should expect a consolidation now between 26 cents and 34 cents for a while. It's gonna calm down a little bit. You have to wait to see what is the next move on Gods Unchained. But this is crypto and some coins will move fast. You don't know how fast they will go. So you have no choice but to be in some of these assets beforehand. Coming in later, it's extremely tricky and you can get caught, especially if there are pumps and then followed by dumps this coin could also come back to 18 cents that's the risk here so that's why we need to confirm if this is a new uptrend or just a pump and dump in the gaming narrative that includes gods on chain so now we have the daily chart for gods on chain and you see that the long term trend was down and still down why is it still down? Because the ME200 is going down. The ME50 is going down. Therefore, we were in a big correction. Who knew when we would rebound? But this huge volumes in the last two days, these are the two green candles here, have made the ME50 turned and the ME200 now is flat. So these moves are quite important to see if we can change the trend of the asset. We were going down, now we hope to be a little flat, maybe a little bit, and then continue upwards. That's what we expect. The other key point, we broke the MA50 and the MA200 in one single candle. That is extremely bullish. So we went through a lot of people here, meaning shorts, got probably liquidated here, and we got a little squeeze that allowed us to go as high as 34 cents. That's probably what happened. Second, we are above the ME200, even though we pump extremely well. So the consolidation needs to keep, need to be above the ME200 in order this to be valid. And we need to have another push upwards in price towards 40 cents. If we get that, then the downtrend is off and completed for Gods Unchained. If we come back below the MA200, then we could have a situation of a pump and dump. And finally, the volume. These two candles are way above average from what we have seen since the beginning of 2024. So a lot of buying happened in a very short period of time. People got liquidated and this explain the god candle here for gods unchained we are expecting this type of candle for bitcoin we will get one we don't know but in this case gods unchanged got it and you know in the last three months with these candles gods unchanged is up 44 percent and in the last month we are at plus 57 percent but in the last week we just doubled in price. So this is the 
volatility to expect in crypto and sometimes if you're in an asset you can absorb and get those returns in a fairly short period of time those people who bought at 15 cents congrats because you double your money in a few days please take some profits not financial advice just to make sure that you don't lose this opportunity so keep that in mind for future assets if you have a conviction on them be in the asset before the big move only a few days in the whole bull market will give you the returns that are associated with the asset in this case yesterday was one of the biggest day of the year for gods and chain so i hope you enjoyed this video see you all on the next one